Hello, my name is Caitlin Reyes. I'm a dietetic intern here at Lamar University. In this video, we're going to be going over how to safely freeze different foods. Freezing your own food is a great way to reduce food waste and have convenient, long-lasting meals. In order to properly freeze your own food, you're going to need certain materials like freezer-safe bags or airtight freezer-safe containers. On top of proper storage material, there are also ways that you can prepare your food that will let it retain its quality once being frozen. Blanching is a cooking method that is very important to maintain quality when freezing vegetables. It involves boiling vegetables anywhere from 1 to 10 minutes, transferring them to ice cold water to stop the cooking process, draining, drying, and freezing. When freezing fruit, wash first and then allow it to dry completely before freezing. This will help the fruit maintain its quality. When freezing meat, fish, or poultry, use a freezer-safe plastic bag or an airtight freezer-safe container. The shelf life of foods that you freeze yourself varies from one month to a year. It really just depends on the type of food that you're freezing. Freezer burn occurs when the product loses moisture due to being exposed to air. This is why using airtight containers or freezer safe bags are important in the prevention of freezer burn. You can tell that a product has freezer burn if it is dual in color and ice crystals have formed. Foods damaged by freezer burn are not necessarily unsafe to eat, but will have an off-putting taste and have a drier, tough texture when cooked. 